Good day everybody, this is Mr Oz Video 1985 here, Mr Oz, Nathan, with you with a Dippity and Blur and Update for December 2013 Part 1. So there'll be several different parts coming up this month, because it's been Christmas and all that. I have a few other parts coming up probably before Christmas. And so yes, um, of course last time I actually did a DVD and Blu-ray update was this chicken my page up before hold on, hold on, hold on. I think it was the 15th was the last time I did a um, DVD and Blu-ray update for movies anyway I did a, another um, video this week which was my a TV show update so so the last one I did was back in November long, November of last month, so pretty long time. So this time around I'll be showing DVDs and Blu-rays. I've got about six six DVDs. About eleven Blu-rays. Some I have some I have seen, some I haven't. So I'll get the ones that I have seen and have watched first. I'll do those ones. The first one is is the Wolverine. Um, of course, stars who um, Jack. I got I, this came out last week. Last week I think. And I paid. And this is just a DVD. I paid fifteen dollars for this um, because JB Hi-Fi, which is the store I got this from, had a twenty percent off last week or oh, I just finished yesterday and I got this for $15 so yes Wolverine I really enjoyed this one I really did um a lot of people say it's better than the origin I know I enjoy the origin I actually went to see that in the cinema so yes um even to this day I haven't watched the three X-Men films I think I've seen bits and pieces of them on them on television. I do have them on DVD. I just haven't got around watching them. I have seen um, first uh, first class. I have seen Origin. So it's a Wolverine. I really enjoy this one. I probably will after holidays. We'll probably watch it again and do a review of this. Another one people have kind of mixed opinions on. It is Pacific Rim. Um, this is the DVD and Ultraviolet. Um, basically, you know, giant robots fighting giant monsters, sort of. I really enjoyed this one. It's really just, as I said, just. It really just, it didn't have much of a story to it. It really was more just about action and all that. It's just a movie just to put on, even like monsters and robots and fighting one another kind of things. But I really enjoyed this one. Really did. I'll probably do the same, I'll probably watch it again before and I'll do a probably review of this. Um, another one I actually, two of these I actually watched yesterday was um, the 50th anniversary edition of Highlander. Um, of course, stars Chris Lampton, or the comments in the same, and Sean Curry. Of course, about the immortals and um, things like that. Of course, the Not Highlanders have made other movies of this, and they even made, even made a TV series as well. So, I really enjoy this sort of fighting mystery kind of things. So, yes, Highlanders. Another one I watched, I just watched yesterday, was um, starring Kevin Costner, Costner in Robin Hood, Men, Robin Hood, Men of the, um, Prince of the, um, Thieves. This is the extended version. Um, I'm pretty sure I watch. I've seen this before. It's a long time ago, anyway. I really enjoy this. A very different, a very different um, tale. On that. A lot of people say this is kind of the best Robin Hood for, for a long time. Um, I, I actually, a couple of weeks ago, watched the Robin Hood, the one that came out recently with um, with uh, Russell Crowe. I don't really enjoy that one too, but yes. Very good one. Of course, this has Kevin Costner, um, and has seen has uh, Morgan Freeman, has Alan Rickman. So yes, Robin Hood, 
Prince of Thieves. And two of them I picked up in the JB's 20% um, off, which I have, two of these I have seen uh, if it was on TV or then back a couple of months ago. First one was Lost in Space. Um, I really do Lost in Space. I do remember watching this when it came out back in 1998. I really enjoyed it. I'm looking forward to trying to pick up the um, the TV series for Lost in Space because I do remember watching it. So yes, Lost in Space. And the other one is Galaxy Quest. Um, of course, stars Tim Allen. Um, of course, this is kind of a spoof for when we call it a to Star Trek. And so there's another one I want to watch again, and I'll probably talk about this in our upcoming video. So those are the DVDs. Moving on to the Blu-rays. The first one I picked up was The Terminator, starring um, of course good old Arnie, and this is the kind of kind of look into it. Now I do have the um, the other Terminator films. I have. I think the second one on DVD, which may upgrade to Blu-ray, and I do have the third one and the fourth one, which also says right thing. Cover at the back. Um, also comes with a um, little kind of book as well. Is it his information? Right there. Little book that comes with it. I really enjoyed this one. Um, it's like, 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 many, like a lot of movies, it, it seems to get played a lot. Um, this one, you know, like Terminator movies, seems to get played a lot, especially on the sci fi channel. Um, and you know, like a lot of other movies, like the Back of the Future films, he seems to get played a lot. Even the Internet Jones films seem to get played a lot, so yes, the Terminator film. We get the earliest ones quickly. We have another one starring Kevin Costa in The Postman. Um, this is kind of a poke apocalypse kind of film. Uh, things like that, so yes. I'm Robot starring um, Will Smith, which was only on TV only, I think it was last weekend. So yes. I'm Robot. I wanted to come out in the 80s, Flash Gordon. I think I have seen this, I think I have seen this before, but it's been a long time. Um, one starring um, Dennis Quaig in Pranorm, Pranorm, something rum, I mean, or something, that one there. The Call. Um, G.I. Joe Redemption Redemption, is it? Renegade? Oh, oh there, sorry about the We got Frinsic Finka Twees, or what do you want to call her? So I want uh, Tom Cruise with the Madonna Report. Space Cowboys. And Skyline, Skyline, which is supposed to be in the same kind of thing. I think came out um, basically similar to Battleship, uh, Battleship, um, Battle, Battle, Battle LA, but these aliens and all that. So yes, so I did go through those ones quickly because I don't want to make this a long video. So yeah, that is a DVD and Blu-ray update. Um, as you can tell, most of the Blu-rays I pick through sci-fi films. So yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. Any of them you have seen, please feel to leave a comment underneath. Any of these films you want me to talk about in an upcoming video, either my um, series that I'm kickstarting next year, my well, restarting next year, my sci-fi rewind series, or generally, please leave a comment underneath. And other other thing you want to recommend to me, please leave a comment underneath as well. So this is a part one of probably a th 
could become more parts before Christmas. And so yes, until my next video, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.